And a group forum of civil society, FCAs, has rejected the suspension of Dr. Beta Redu from her position as the Minister of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Elevation over alleged misappropriation of funds. Addressing a press conference in Lagos, the group stressed that the allegations against the minister were not only sponsored by detractors of ongoing reforms and the administration of President Bola Amitinubu, but are also annoyed about the manner Edu has coordinated the affairs of the ministry. The organization said it has closely monitored developments surrounding the rumors of corruption in the disbursement of social intervention funds by Dr. Betaridu, describing them baseless and without merit. It said Dr. Betaridu has been unwavering in her commitment to serving the Nigerian people and her dedication to the welfare of citizens is commendable. After all that has been said and done over the suspension of the minister, the minister of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, Dr. Beta Edu, I stand on the point that the allegation levied against him, against her, is a total fallacy, and it has been rejected. On this point, standing on this podium, I am calling on the president of our great country, Nigeria, President Bolaha Metinumbu, to have a rethink on the suspension over the fraud that has been alleged to Dr. Beta Edu. Dr. Mrs. Edu, that has been suspended, is not to be accorded to. Mrs. Edu did not do such thing. So all the allegation leveled against her is fallacy. So I will call on the president of Nigeria to look into it and see that please she should be reinstated into her position as the Minister of Humanitarian and Pub Poverty Alleviation.